It always shows that we're live, but yet it's not right away. You're live. We're live. Hi, everybody. How's everybody doing tonight? Come down to the comments and let us know if you're here already. Thumbs up on our volume. How's everything sound? We have some winter jazz music tonight. Thanks to AJ. I'm not pulling it up. Mine's not coming up. The, um, oh, just go, yeah, go back to color, scroll, scroll a little bit. There you go. Hit, click, hit, click on that. There I am. So, Let's see who's. No, 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 no. Hit, click on that. On that okay. so it opens. There you go. Oh, there good. You go. Okay. Hi, Renee. Hi, Becky. Hi, Pam. Melissa. Stephanie. How's everybody? Did you have a nice Christmas? And for those of you that are still celebrating for Hanukkah, we're still going on. We celebrated Hanukkah tonight with our kids. We had a wonderful Christmas, and I hope all of you enjoyed your Christmas as well. Ellie said she had a wonderful Christmas. So happy to hear that. Hi, Jean from Michigan. Hi, Belinda. We'll be getting started at nine o'clock. So we have a couple minutes. Let us know what you have planned for New Year's Eve, if you have any exciting plans, or if you just wanna tell us about anything that you were able to color during Christmas. Hi, Karen. How's the volume? Hello, Alicia. Hi, Erin. Hello, Amber. Okay, we'll be getting started at nine o'clock. I'm just gonna pause the music for a bit. Hello, Color It friends. Thank you so much for joining us tonight and welcome to Color It Live episode 14. If you're just joining in, please come down to the comments and say hello to us and let us know where you're tuning in from. As always, if you have any comments or questions during the show, AJ and Mike will be answering them throughout the episode. We really appreciate those of you who are joining in for the first time. If you are joining in for the first time, please come down to the comments and let us know if it's your first time joining us. And thank you to all of those who have been joining us week after week. We really appreciate it. If you ever do miss a Color It Live episode, you can always find that on Facebook under videos. And also, if you haven't liked our Facebook page, please like our page. I wanna share with you our YouTube channel so you know where to subscribe so i'll show you that you're just going to go over here to color it coloring books and over here you just click subscribe and you can also catch any color it videos and if you'd like to share them you can share them with your friends and family if you could please share out our channel just so you all know we're going to be having a giveaway tonight and we'll be selecting one lucky viewer to receive a color it product of your choice. So please stay till the very end. And also if you could share out our color it live tonight, if you know anyone that would enjoy this episode, that would be great. 2016 has truly been an amazing year for color it. And we released 10 coloring books this year, our best, selling gel pens and our dual tip alcohol markers. So to celebrate our amazing year, we're going to be running a sale. We're giving 10% off your entire order at colorit.com. So you're just gonna use the code. I'm getting a lot of hearts. <laughs> Thank you. Year end 10 at checkout. 
So also remember, any order over $30 after the discount is applied qualifies for free shipping. So again, that's year end 10 at checkout. We want to start out this week a little different. We're going to be showing off our favorite drawings from our color community. So are you guys ready to see some of these amazing drawings? First up, we have Debbie Vaughn Davis Marie, and she was um, able to share with us from our Christmas drawings. Last week, we also shared some photos of our Christmas drawings that were used as ornaments, and we also shared Christmas cards that were used. So here's another great example of using a color page and she was able to have her granddaughter who colored this in and she framed and displayed a beautiful job. So thank you for sharing that out with us. Debbie, are you on tonight, Debbie? If you are, come down to the comments and let us know. Judith is next. We have Judith Watson from Mandalas to Color Volume 1 and you can really appreciate all these beautiful colors and the red with the purple and brown. If you want, come down to the comments and let us know what you think of this beautiful manzala. Thank you. Next is Marla Theodoro. What a beautiful job from Manzalas to Color Volume 2. I love how the lime green pops in the center. Great choice. We have Michelle Busher, and this is from Wild Animals. Beautiful pink flamingo. And she says, just some relaxing today. This looks great. We have uh, next, Becky Wilson. Hi, Becky, I know you're on tonight from Colors of the Ocean. This is the first coloring submission that we received from uh, our Colors of the Ocean book. So thank you for sending that in. And this is amazing. I love the seahorse. One of my sister-in-laws loves seahorses, so I have to share this with her for sure. We have Dominic Lair from Blissful Scenes. Gorgeous. Beautiful apples and all the reds and greens. We have Lisa Lebrano from Mandalas to Color, Volume 2. Gorgeous with the hot pink center. What do you guys think of that one? We have Debbie Brown from Mandalas to Color, Volume 2, with our pink snowflake, and she used Color It gel pens. Looks beautiful. Karen Armstrong is up next, and I see lots of thumbs up with our mermaids, and she says she just loves our products. Thank you, Karen. We're glad you're enjoying all of, our, all of your color it products. We have Jackie Foot from Blissful Scenes, and she colored in the desert plants on the ladder. Gorgeous job with that, Jackie. She said she just finished this page from Blissful Scenes, and she says this is her favorite color it book. We have Chris Morgan from Mythical and Fantasy who colored the gnome in the garden. This came out awesome, great job. Jennifer Baker, Mythical and Fantasy book, and this looks amazing with the different colors of the um, silver and grays and the brown. Beautiful contrast there. What do you guys think? Come down to the comments and let us know. We have Dawn Giacone from Mandalas to Color, Volume 2. Gorgeous job, beautiful color scheme here with the blues and purple and pink and green. Great job. Jan Olson, I think she's on tonight. We have from Cats, Kittens, and Wild Cats. Beautiful job, Jan. 
We have Dorothy Johnson from the 10 free sample drawings. Look at that turtle. Looks like it's walking across the table. <laughs> Beautiful job. Dorothy says, I got this with my 10 free pictures and I finished it in two hours yesterday. I love coloring this turtle and all the pictures I got with it. We're so happy you are enjoying them, Dorothy. Great job. We have Shane's Gay from Blissful Scenes who did the ice cream cart. This is one of my favorites since I love ice cream so much. And <laughs> such a great job with the different color balloons. And I love the blue and white contrast there. And she used color it markers here. We have Katie C from Mandalas to Color Volume 2. And you can really see the difference in the comparison here. You have the same design, but in different colors. And you really can see the orange and the blue compared to the red and the blue. What a beautiful job with that. Thank you, Katie. Thank you guys so much for everyone that shares their submissions. It's so wonderful for us to see all of the drawings come in and especially from our newer books. We just love seeing your creations. If you have submissions that you wanna share with us, you're gonna use hashtag MyColorIt on Instagram, Pinterest, Twitter, and Facebook. You can also post your submission to ColorIt.com Facebook visitor post. So what do you guys think about these beautiful submissions? Let us know, come down to the comments hit the like or love button if you saw a specific design that inspired your creativity let us know please come down to the comments and share your thoughts with us and just to celebrate this amazing year we are running a 10 percent off your entire order at colorit.com so you're just going to use the code year and 10 at checkout and any order over $30 after the discount is applied qualifies for free shipping. So for two weeks, we've been having these coloring sessions, which have been going amazing. And everyone has been sharing with us how much fun they're having coloring. So we decided why not do it again tonight? So if you're excited, let's see some thumbs up that we're going to be coloring for tonight, we're gonna select, you. well, you guys are gonna select for me, one of the pages from the Best of Color It book. And I'm gonna share with you first, if you're not familiar with our Best of Color It, this is what the book looks like. But first, let me go to my overhead camera because I wanna share with you the design that I colored last week with all of you. Let me just make sure you can see that. Erica, while you're going to that, it's really awesome. I'm reading a lot of the comments here, and I'm seeing how all the members of the community are really enjoying seeing all of the other designs by everyone else. So we're happy to be able to put that out and share that and show all the beautiful colors. And please go to colorit.com, go to our gallery and upload some of your designs. We'll be so happy to share them with the community. And it really looks like the community is really happy to see all the beautiful designs out there. Thank you everyone so much. So here's my completed creation from last week. What do you guys think? Should I read the comments? Are you, are you all being, oh, I see lots of love, good. So you all love what I did. <laughs> I couldn't stop when we ended the episode. I just continued on, and I'm so happy that we can um, share that out with you guys tonight. So let's go over um, the best of Color It. We came out with this book so people who are new to Color It could experience our amazing coloring books firsthand at a low price point. The best of Color It is $9.99. It includes 30 pages and three designs from our 10 different books. So of course we have the spiral binding at the top, the hard covers for any first time viewers. This is a great book to start off with. You have, with all of our books, we have the belongs to page 
<clears throat> so everyone will know that your, your, that your book belongs to you. We have some tips, our blotter, all of our paper is high artist quality paper. We have perforated and your all the pages are perforated so you can tear them out. And if you're using the markers, you're gonna wanna use that blotter. So as I'm flipping through, if all of you can come down to the comments and let us know which design and which book you would like to see me color this evening. And hopefully, you all join in and color along with us tonight. So you have, this is from Around the World in 50 Pages, Wild Doodles, Nina Marie Roche, Mythical and Fantasy. Tracy said she loves the top binding. Yeah, a lot of times people complain about struggling with a side binding with our books. It's nice because you can have the ease of being right-handed or left-handed, and the top binding really makes it nice, especially when you're on the go. You can fold it back. You don't have to worry about being at a desk. Here's one of my favorites, my warrior princess. <laughs> Love that one. Erica, so far, early here, it looks as if we're getting a lot of requests for the mermaid and a few I see for the sea turtles and quite a few for uh, the windmill from around the world. How about the cupcakes? I, I like the cupcakes. It's my favorite. Well, <laughs> one, I always say that this one's my favorite. That one's my favorite. They're all, oh, I have a lot of favorites, but this is one of my favorites. I love this one. Okay, so come down to the comments and let us know which design you would like to see us color tonight. And also um, put in some colors because I'm going to be using our markers this evening. And if you have certain colors that you'd like to see, let me know. Hi, Erica Burstein. Thanks for joining us. That's my best friend, everyone. One of my best friends, I should say. Yeah, so we're now getting a lot for the cupcakes. Still are quite a few for the mermaids. I'm just flipping through we're again, getting, just in case. We're getting a few for the cats. Susan Stevens says the lion or the warrior princess. I love the warrior princess. More for the cupcakes. Becky said it makes her too hungry to see the. <laughs> I like this uh, wild doodle one too. That one would be nice. And I also want to take a moment here to really thank everyone that is sharing this out for us. We're getting quite a few shares out there tonight, and we are Thanks, giving guys. out the. We are going to be giving out the ten percent code. Erica, did you already give that out? Yeah, I'll be mentioning that again, um, just so that you guys know. Um, it is year end 10 at checkout, year end 10. If you want to share out this episode with your friends so that they can take advantage of the year end 10 at checkout. And also they'll get to see us coloring tonight too, which will be fun. All right, so what's the vote? What do you think? I'm seeing a lot of cupcakes. I'm seeing a lot of cupcakes. I saw a lot of windmill. I saw a lot of mermaids. Renee Kirsch said the cupcakes are going to want to make her bake again. I feel like we did cookies, though, last week, so we have to change it up a little bit. You want to change it up a little bit? <laughs> the mermaids I saw. I don't know. Every page is so... The fairy with the dragon is beautiful. I have to do one where someone's neck doesn't have to be turned. So we have to be able to, because someone was complaining that they had to turn their head last week the whole time. So I want to make sure that I'm able to color and that they can see without me having to um, 
Erica, while you're deciding, I just want to throw out there that we've had 27 shares so far on this video, and we're consistently over 200 viewers so far. So, really, thank you so much to everyone out there watching. Please thank come you down. So much to the color community. Please come down to the comments and let us know if you shared so we can thank you because that's huge, and I want to make sure I mention you and thank you specifically. So, if you shared tonight's episode, come down to the comments, please. Let us know if you shared. Okay, so what are we doing? So I think we narrowed it down here if we're going according to everything that's coming through. Getting a lot for the mermaids, getting a lot for the lion, and a lot for the windmill. And I am just getting a text message through from Mike who's watching the comments a little bit closer than I am because I'm kind of interacting with you here. And Mike reads, he thinks the windmill is winning. Okay, so the windmill is the winner for tonight. We're gonna go, wow, that line is but. nice. All right, we'll go with the windmill tonight. Don't worry, we're gonna be coloring again next week. I think I can't see. Can and guys, thanks so much. I know there's so many more of you who shared. I'm just looking at the comments right here. The comments go so Thank you, fast. Leanne, for sharing. Susan shared. Ellie shared. Renee shared. Christine shared. Carol shared. Yeah, they're like blasting through. They blast right through. I see Deborah. Angela. Michelle, thank Karen. you. Where's the windmill? Renee loves us and always shares. Danielle, Hello, Deb, Amanda. Claudette shared. Elizabeth shared. Thanks, guys. Wow, guys, you guys we're up, are we're so up to awesome. 38 shares. Thank you so much. Why can't I find the limo? <laughs> if I wasn't able to personally thank you for sharing, it means so much to us. Thank you so much. Uh, we're so happy to be here with you, coloring with you. Thank you, Michelle, for sharing. Kathy, Bonnie. You guys are awesome. And guys, Facebook just informed me we are over a thousand comments. That's that's really spectacular. Thanks so much. Okay, so Oh Jessica Jessica Haga asked, what book do the cupcakes come from? And that is the Blissful Scenes book. The Blissful Scenes book, which if you use the code Erica gave you tonight, you can get ten percent off that book and all other color products at colorit.com. And Michael will be coming down to um, put it into the live feed as well, so you'll see that there, if he hasn't already. So I'm starting off with orange. Please also come down to the comments and let us know the colors. The first five colors that we see in the comments, we will be adding here to the flowers. And I'm trying to color so the like the other direction so that you guys don't have to turn your head tonight. Christina Kane asks, can someone tell where the book with the compass with the dolphin is in? Christina, that is in Colors, Colors of the Ocean. I see yellow, okay. Dominic loves blissful scenes. Thank you for sharing that. I see blue, yellow so far. Red, green. This is hard to color this way because I'm not I'm not turning the book. But see the beauty of not having a binding in your way, you can make that happen. You could actually do it along with a friend and they could color one section and you can color the other. So Belinda, Belinda has suggested orange, purple, pink, and yellow. And we did get a question about Blissful Scenes. Is it in stock yet? Not just yet, but we did get confirmation it is on the way today, right? And on its way to Amazon and to our warehouse? Yes. Okay. And we will let, let you know as soon as it's in. So we're working very hard on getting that. Sold quite a bit over the holidays, but we will we'll let you know. We'll we'll keep the community update on that. Keep watching the Facebook page and we'll let you know as soon as everything's in, but it is in the works right now. We're on top of that. 
Michelle Busher, she won the markers last Wednesday. Can't put them down. Her favorite markers by far, by far. Thank you, Color, and thank you, Michelle. Jamie Steele asked if it is snowing where we live. It is not snowing here in the Northeast, and I am sure it is not snowing out in San Diego where Mike is right now. <laughs> If anyone else wants to comment, let us know where it's snowing out there. We'd love to hear. Lupe Saracino, I'm left-handed, so coloring like this is par for the course. Perfect. Oh. There's a big smile there. I know I, I, the, the, the energy of the comment is very positive. Um, <laughs> I'm going to get to the I blue. Like that one. The blue tulips next. Kathy, yes, we had a wonderful Christmas here with the family. It's our favorite time of year. Hope you had a wonderful Christmas as well. Joyce says she's finished four books already. That's amazing. Great job there. And it is snowing in Parksville, British Columbia. <laughs> Mike, who lives in San Diego, where it's 85 degrees, sunny, and zero humidity all year round, asked, what is snow? <laughs> it's white, Mike. Very funny. <laughs> Kathleen Trana said it's snowing in Motley. Beverly Dulmore, not snowing in Ohio. Danielle Bell, snowing in Minnesota. No snow in Indiana, from Bobby Barnes. So then Sweeney writes, she has cerebral palsy, so the gel pens work nice for her hands. You can see um, with these markers how smooth they just glide across the paper, and it's just such a great experience, as do the gel pens. But when you're seeing this, hopefully you can see it up close how nice and vibrant the colors are. Now, we have two dual tip that you can see we have the chisel and the fine. I'm using the fine to get into the smaller spaces here. But the nice thing about the chisel is it has a pointy side on the top so you could get into smaller creases as well with that side if you needed to. Shanice Gay has her air conditioner on in Georgia. She kind of has the opposite of snow going on down there. Give us some more colors. Let us know what colors you want to see. I have blue, yellow, orange. Erica, check this out from Sherry Bristow Sterner. Sterner. I treated myself to the markers, gel pens, and pencils for Christmas. Wow, am I impressed. You have a wonderful product. Just ordered my first coloring book. Thank you so much. You're going to love it. Sherry, let us know down in the comments what book you ordered. And we are so happy that you treated yourself and you're loving our products. We'd love to see your creations once you start coloring in the books. Share them with the Color It community for sure. We see them. Nina Marie, no snow in Florida. Kathy Gibbs shared again. Thanks again, Kathy. Yes, please let us know if you're sharing out this episode so we can thank you guys. What other colors do you guys? Purple, purple, okay. You get into the purples. We have a lot of pretty purples. Alexandra Martinez, she started the cupcakes, but every time she works on them, she gets hungry. Alexandra, please share the finished design. We can't wait to see it. Angela Huston Trustee is asking how long do the markers last when coloring? It really is going to be dependent upon how much you're using it on each page. I guess a few other factors, how far you're stretching the marker, but maybe some of the other members of the community who have the markers um, and have been coloring for quite a bit can put some comments down for us. We have a specific, um, it's uh, 300, I think they, they have like a specific um, 300, I think it's called... I think Michael put it in the comments, but it's like 300 meters. or I don't know okay. what the specific terminology is. But yeah, Mike, if you have the technical you... answer for that, go ahead. And then if some of the other colorists out there can answer that question and let us know um, 
the experience you've been having. That'd be great. Lori Palmer, my mother is now addicted to coloring since I bought her one of your bundles. Thanks, Lori, and we hope your mom continues to enjoy coloring. Mary Ann Wenzel wants to see some lime green for the leaves on the tulips. Okay, you got it. I was trying to... Um... Lupe is loving the flower look already. Janice Larson loves her gel pens and Blissful Scenes coloring book. Karen Armstrong, she's stocking up so when she retires, she'll be coloring all day. That's awesome. From Sherry McNew. Ooh, the blue pops. That purple was really dark there. So how do you guys decide which um, page that you want to color when you get your book and you're setting out on different coloring pages? Come down to the comments and let us know how you make that decision. Let's hear some music too while we are. How's the music? I just hit that. Hopefully it's not too loud. Just let me know. Thumbs up. Eric, I have a question here. Are you using the blotter? <gasps> I did not. Shame on me. That was bad. I did not. So Erica did not use the blotter, so let's I went on to the, And our paper is artist quality, and this is a very high artist quality marker too that um and I'll show you how it barely goes through the and I'll, and I'm pressing really hard too. So you're always gonna want to fold your blotter back and then it tears out very easily. Just so you can see where I just lost them. I can't believe I forgot to do that. Well, we got a lot going on here. You're running a live show. You're <laughs> coloring. You, you <laughs> certainly have a lot on your mind. You're DJing over there. Yeah. While you're doing that, Erica, I have some answers here on the markers. Angela Latham wrote, if you color like I do, you're better off buying two packs of markers or gel pens at a time. I guess Angela's coloring quite a bit. Kathy Gibbs writes, I have been using the marker since October and still going strong. So you can see it's lightly onto the cat right there, but not terribly. So sometimes when you use a alcohol-based marker through other coloring books with different quality paper, it could actually go through 30 pages. It's actually happened to me. So this is pretty good there. And um, you want to have some saturation so you can see you want the marker to go through the paper a little bit so you have that vibrance. Okay, there. Now, I have my blotter. I'm going to continue. Can everyone hear the music? Volume was good. I missed that if the volume was okay. What other colors do you want to say thank you, Deb? She says our paper is amazing. We, we spent countless, countless hours as a team trying to find the perfect paper. We have a few answers coming in for how some of the members of the community choose the page they're going to color. Elizabeth Douglas flips through until a page grabs and screams, color me. Angela Hudson, she generally looks through the pictures and selects two or three, then goes back and tries to imagine in color and chooses from there. Susan Stevens flips through, and if a picture strikes an emotion or memory of something nice or special, that's the picture. And then how do you decide on your color scheme? I'm seeing a few requests in here for red flowers, Erica, so... Okay, red's next. Get red in there. Red's going to be next, everyone. Red, 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 I see. <laughs> Becky Wilson said that she forgot her blotter once, too, the hard way. <laughs> she 
found out the hard way by forgetting her bladder as well. Cinnamon Owen says, I love how the paper is top quality and thick. I have not found it in any other book. That means so much to us because, like I said, we put so much time into finding the perfect paper for all of your mediums. Because not only do you want it to work well with your marker set, you want it to work well with your pencils and gel pens and you really do see how nice this paper works with different mediums. Oh, red. Alicia M. Wilson wrote, where is the best place to get the markers you are using? And the best place to get the markers is at colorit.com. And Erica, if you could give the 10% off code again, so Alicia can go ahead and get 10% off the markers. So your 10% off code is going to be year end 10 at checkout. Year end 10. Erica, you're definitely not alone. Bobby Barnes forgot her blotter one time. Mm -hmm. And Marianne C. Wenzel loves the purple tulip. Nice for contrast. Thank you. Wow, listen to this from Siobhan Olaher. Hopefully I said that right, Siobhan. Sorry about that. Uh, Olaher. My bird picks my pages. I flip the pages, and when she chirps, that's the one. Siobhan, does your bird pick out a lot of the bird images that we have from wild animals or blissful scenes? Let us know. Ruthie said, I only color with the best. <laughs> Thank you, Ruthie. Okay, so now we have the... Marsha Albert Anderson, you did a great job in getting good paper. We really did search high and low. Uh, paper is one of the key ingredients that makes our book up to the quality standards that we wanted to create and it seems that uh, the community really appreciates and we hold very strong to our standards. I remember I think a week or two ago it was even asked our, do we have any plans of going on Shark Tank or some of the other things we may do and what's most important to the color of family and what we want to always give to our community is the highest quality coloring book out there. And if any opportunity we ever have compromises that, it's just not an opportunity for us. And we're up to over 45 shares out there. Thank you so much, everyone. Thanks, we love everybody. the shares and we're gonna continue to give out that 10% code for you and anyone else that watches this live show tonight. So how do you guys get your inspiration when you're trying to pick a design to color? Tracy Stancil Branson, most of the time I go with what strikes my fancy for colors, but I also keep a Pinterest board of color palettes for inspiration. Does anyone go to the Color It Community Gallery to look for color schemes? I know I do. <laughs> I love it. And thanks to Alita K, uh, K. Scanlon, she actually shared the code year end 10. Thank you. If anyone else wants to go ahead and share that code, feel free to share it right here on the live show. Share it with your friends off the show. We would love to get that code out to as many people that would love to enjoy our color of products. Karen says, I've tried other products, but yours are the best and the only one to you and I only want to use yours that's awesome thank you so much that's what it's all about guys when we hear these great comments it just makes us feel so good Dawn person Zorinsky I can't wait to order more of the books now that I have one I'm addicted Diane Acolino Salvamini. It depends what mood I'm in. Mm -hmm. so I guess if she's hungry, she colors cupcakes. If she's going to the zoo, she goes to wild animals. Kathy Gibbs says she needs another book. Another mandala, I'm guessing, right, Kathy? Paula Coley, I'm getting my pens, pencils, and markers tomorrow. Can't wait to start using them. Awesome. Amy 
Amy Roberts, totally new to this. I want all of your products. My birthday is Monday, so hopefully my husband will order some for me. Well, Amy, go ahead and give your husband the code year N10 so he can get 10% off those products for you. Year N10. Welcome, Amy. Thanks for joining us. Any other first time viewers with us tonight? Let us know. Angela writes, I shared my books with two of my nephews this past week and they sat in color for over an hour. They are 11 and 12 years old, the quietest they had been all week. Holly Soptic, I also have a number of products for coloring, but I think Color It is by far the best. A lot of our viewers tonight are saying your picture is coming out awesome. Thanks, everyone. You were always good with colors, Eric. Right from right from the start. Remember, I think we told this story before, but yeah. when we were first working on the covers, and I was just hitting a wall and walking away from the computer, taking deep breaths, and then uh, I would come back a few hours later, and you had an outrageous color scheme. Or I would wake you up at three in the morning and say, "You have to see this. I want to see if you like this." <laughs> you get me up out of bed to see if I like the color scheme. <laughs> Leslie McDonald Davenport, first time watching, can't see where to save your information. So Leslie, if you just like the color page, you will see the, uh, you should see when we have a live show popping up in your news feed. And also if you are on the color it mailing list, you can get on the list at colorit.com. We do send out a reminder every Wednesday that the show will be live at 9 p.m. Eastern on Facebook. Okay, I have one tool up left. I'm, I'm trying to do this crooked so that you guys don't have to turn your head, but let me just see. Take one second. Okay. Um, so there's one tool up that I have to color in. What color? Whoever gets to the comment box first with a color, I will use your suggestion. Joyce Spear, this is my first night with you, and I'm really enjoying it. Happy to have so you, So happy to have you. Joyce's profile picture is a wheel of colored pencils. So what helps you guys relax when you're coloring most? Orange it is. Going with orange? Yep. <laughs> Carol Newman, I care for seniors, and we now have a coloring club. Afternoon tea and coloring. They all love your books. Time to order new pens, too. That's awesome, Carol. Thank you. Erica picks the best colors. <laughs> Aw. No, you guys all do. And it looks like with Grace Dobson's share, we are up to 50 shares. Thanks so much, everyone. Thank you guys so much. And remember to get out the year end 10. It's year end 10, right, Erica? Year end 10. So you're going to go to colorit.com for your savings. And um, let me know what you guys think of the coloring session. If you like that tonight, give some thumbs up, hearts. Don't forget, we're going to be having one viewer that's going to be selected to win a Color It product. So make sure you stay with us to the very end, a Color It product of your choice. So please stay with us and don't go anywhere. Leave us a comment if you want to let us know what we should do next. And just um, before we get to that, we're going to announce um, a few quick things before we get to the um, winner. So let me share my screen. A couple of interesting comments I have here before you move on, Erica. Angela wrote, have y'all ever considered doing a book with a black background? The gel pens look so awesome against it. I actually, yeah. We you have thought of that? I actually... Well, I, I was trying to figure out the paper that, that you would need to use for that. If anyone thinks that that's a good idea, thanks so much for the suggestion, Angela. If anyone thinks that that's something they'd like to see, let's see some comments below because 
We, we always discuss everything, just like last week with the sugar skulls. Once we get into the new year, that's going to be something we're going to discuss. Uh, if you guys think that's a good idea, let us know. And Julie Muller writes... Oh, Lucy. Lucy said, wow, you should show your face more. You're beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That's so sweet. <laughs> I married you for a reason, babe. I love you. You're beautiful. All right. So how Real is quick, your... Before, before we move on, <laughs> Julie Muller, I'm new to this, and I like everything that I see, and I'm hearing about can you only use the code tonight? Mike, if you could please write that down in the comments, how long uh, that code, year and 10, is going to be good, just so we can let everyone know uh, how much time they have on that. Okay, so before we get to our quick announcements, I just want to ask if any of you could share your colored experience, how it's impacted you this year, and any advice you have for first-time viewers who are new to coloring and also about Color It. If you can come down to the comments and share your opinion, that would be great. So December, we had our Fan of the Month contest, and just a few days are left for you to upload a color it drawing that you colored and have your friends and family vote for you. So the first place winner has a chance of winning a $100 color it gift card, and we have four runner-ups that'll get $20 gift cards. So for your chance to win, you go to color it dot com backslash fan and as a reminder if you want a prize in our monthly giveaways or color it live or if you were a runner up in the fan of the month contest you won't be able to win another contest for a year just to make sure everyone has a fair chance and I just want to share with you some of the new submissions for this month's competition you can see so many beautiful submissions and everybody is getting votes so good luck to everyone you can really see how beautiful these are and you can also get a lot of ideas too so don't forget to include your color gel pens or markers i'm seeing lots of hearts lots of thumbs up Looks like everyone loves these. Make sure you don't forget to vote for your peers in the color community as well. And there you have it. So it's colorit.com backslash. Did I share the screen? I actually didn't. Oh, I'm sorry about that, guys. I didn't share my screen. So let's go through that really quickly. I just wanted to show you some of the new submissions. So it's colorit.com backslash fan. And here are some of the newer submissions. I shared this last week, but I just wanted to update you on these beautiful submissions for the December contest, which is almost up. Lots of hearts. Thank you, guys. There's the cupcakes. Everyone is so supportive of each other. Wow, look at that. Look at this one. Yeah, that's what I was looking at right there from Mythical and Fantasy. Wow. Mm -hmm. Wow, Shannon, really spectacular job 15 on that. votes on that, Shannon. Keep them coming, everybody. Okay, so let me go back. Here I am. While you're doing that, Erica, I have um, a comment here from Stephanie King. Stephanie lost her dad back in May, and coloring really helps her when she's having a bad day. We're, we're happy that awesome. we could provide that for you, and we wish you prayers for the loss of your father and we're happy that coloring is able to provide some light for you for sure our prayers are with you um okay so to celebrate an amazing year we're running a sale if you're just joining us 10 percent off your entire order at colorit.com the code again is year end 10 at checkout any order over $30 after the discount is applied qualifies for free shipping. So let me know if there's any remaining questions for tonight and we'll check that out and then we'll be announcing the lucky winner for our giveaway. <clears throat> Leslie says the gallery is amazing. Love seeing color at friends pictures. 
Carol Newman writes, coloring is the is better than therapy, and you can take it anywhere. I suffer from, yeah. from anxiety, and it helps me deal with life daily. The whole family, any age, can join in at their level. It is fabulous. Color it makes products you can give as gifts or framed. I have several frames of my grandchildren's finished coloring pages. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, Carol. Thanks Happy so much. Happy New Year. Okay, so we have our winner for tonight. Congratulations to Nina Marie. And if you are here, let us know and make sure you send us a Facebook message to claim your prize. Thank you guys for joining us tonight and supporting Color It every day. We truly appreciate you guys so much. We wish you a happy and healthy new year. We're going to be back next Wednesday for Color It Live episode 15 at 9 p.m. Eastern. 6 p.m. Pacific, so please mark your calendars. It's going to be our first episode for 2017. So I hope that you guys will all join us. We hope that you will have a nice evening and free your creativity.